Chris Koo from Quark Speed Solutions and uh, today I'm going to show you how to track your contact form submissions with WordPress and Google Analytics. So right here we have the contact form right here just to give you an idea of what it looks like. If we go into our, the uh, should be on this page, the dashboard, to make it look like I've just logged in. So once we've uh, logged in into WordPress, we go to the contact form here. We're using a plugin called Contact Form 7. Uh, for my purposes, it's a pretty good contact form plugin for WordPress. So what we want to do is scroll down to the bottom and uh, click Show on Additional Settings. And then I've got this little snippet here, which I'll explain to you in a second. So basically, the only thing you need to worry about is this part in between the two quotes here. It's uh, this is uh, the link. This is the the link that will be raised, that will be called in a sense when when you submit the contact form. So we'll just copy that to clipboard and save this change. Just wait. Contact form saved. Okay, so once we're going to Google Analytics, uh, and we've got we're on the edit page. Actually, let me show you how to get there first. Uh, okay, so once we're you know, on the page, we just click on this edit link next to the website we want to edit, and then scroll down here. Oh, this must have been the one I added before. So anyway. How about I click add goal here and we'll just add the same one in a sense. So we'll go sent contact form, active goal, yep. Uh, and then we select URL destination and uh, we select head match here. And the goal URL, we paste in what we want the goal URL to be. This for Actually, this URL does not have to exist. Uh, it, it just needs to be, it, it does not have to exist at all. Okay, sorry, but what you're looking for isn't here. Uh, it will be tracked, but it will still be tracked. So if we set this to one, don't have to set that to one, that's just me. Okay, that's working. So if we go back to contact form, then uh, it's loading. Okay. So if we just there we go. There's my email. Test, test. Then the capture. Then message was successful. Successful. Thanks. So that should be it. Um, I can't actually show you uh, that's actually gone through because Google Analytics typically lags by about a day or so. So I trust that this works. So I hope you've gained something. Uh, maybe I'll even paste in the image just to show that it worked. So you guys are convinced that these instructions work. Okay, have a good day everyone. Bye.